Welcome back to my channel Mathematics and today we have a very tricky challenge 8 plus 8 plus 8 times 0 95% make this common mistake so right now I want you to pause the video and try to solve it by yourself and in the end of the video we will check our answers we will check our solutions it will be really interesting so first of all I want to start with this first interpretation a lot of students solve this challenge like that we have 8 plus 8 plus 8 times zero. Here's our challenge. A lot of students don't care about order of operation. They say, okay, in a strict order from left to right, 8 plus 8 plus 8, which is equal to 24, 24 times zero, which is equal to zero. A lot of students solve these challenges like that. They say, okay, option A is the correct answer, and they go to the next challenge. But in terms of maths, it's really great to know about order of operation. Let's look at this PEMDAS order of operation. This is the most popular order of operation in the world. All internet libraries, scientific, graphic calculators, works according to PEMDAS order of operation. And how does PEMDAS works? PEMDAS works from the top to the bottom. It means that higher position means higher priority. For example, parenthesis has the higher position. It means that parenthesis has the highest priority. Next step is exponents, like 2 square, 2 cube. Next step is multiplication, division, group. Last step is addition and subtraction. So let's solve our challenge according to PEMDAS. Here's our challenge. We have 8 plus 8 plus 8 times 0. Here's our challenge. Let's scan what do we have. We have multiplication right here. We have addition right here. Where do we have multiplication and addition? Multiplication here and addition right here. We don't have any parentheses, we don't have any exponents, we don't have any division and subtraction. We only have multiplication and addition. So what we should do at first? We should multiply or we should add. As I told before, parentheses PEMDAS works from the top to the bottom. It means that higher position means higher priority. Multiplication has the higher position than addition. Multiplication has the higher priority. It means that our first step should be multiplication. We should multiply 8 times 0. What do we have? We have 8 plus 8 plus zero. Yes, we complete our first step multiplication. And our last step, pretty basic, we should add 8 plus 8 plus zero. This is our second step, which is equal to 16. Yes, pretty easy, pretty easy. This is option C. And a lot of students all the time argue with each other about the correct answer. One part of students say that option A is the correct answer, another part of students say that option C is the correct answer. So let's look at our first interpretation. We solve the challenge absolutely randomly. Just from left to right, we can solve our challenges like that. This is absolutely wrong. We should start from, we should start to multiply. Yes, 8 times 0. But in this case, we add 8 plus 8 plus 8, which is equal to 24. This is absolutely incorrect. We can solve our challenges like that. So if we have brackets right here, for example, if we have parentheses, this is a correct answer. This is a correct approach because uh, first we should evaluate the expression inside parentheses, a plus a plus a, which is equal to 24, 24 times 0, which is equal to 0. Yes, this is a correct answer with brackets, with parentheses, but in our case we don't have any brackets, so this is absolutely wrong answer. Let's look at our second interpretation. We solve this challenge according to PEMDAS, order of operation. This is the most popular order of operation in the world. This is absolutely correct answer because uh, first was multiplication, multiplication, 8 times 0, which is equal to 0. And our second step is addition, pretty basic. 8 plus 8 uh, plus 0, which is equal to 16. Option C is the correct answer, guys. Option C is the correct approach, correct solution. So I hope you understand my explanation. I hope your answer is the same as mine. But definitely don't feel bad if you got this wrong. I have a lot of videos on my YouTube channel. So thank you for your time, guys. Have a great day and see you guys in the next videos.